Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Well, hello there, my beautiful Pisces. <laughs> I hope you are doing well today. Thank you for all the beautiful likes, the comments. Oh, hold on a second here. The shares, the subscriptions, the donations to my channel. It is greatly appreciated and well received more than you ever will know. <laughs> Sorry. My cat has uh, seen a spider here, and I have to make sure it's not a brown recluse. It is not. It's uh, what are they? Phididimus. Uh, it's a jumping spider. Plididimus, uh, whatever it is. But yeah, I don't. Yeah, jump. brown recluses. I unfortunately, yeah, those die because um, yeah, they're not good. Uh, one of my cats got bit one time by a brown recluse. It was pretty nasty. So uh, yeah, brown recluses, unfortunately, in this area. So, okay, I gotta put down the holy water. Sorry for the distraction. <laughs> I gotta make sure my kitty's safe. He was like, I'm gonna kill it. Louie, Bailiff Louie, he's on it. He's still looking at it. And that spider knows. He's like trying to make a run for the border, I think, right now. Louie turned his head and the spider's like moving. <laughs> those spiders are smart. There, I love those spiders. Literally, I had a, a spider, one of those jumping spiders one time. Like, literally killed an ant for me. Like, I, I think he thought it was going to hurt me or something. But he killed... I was hanging out with a spider. I know. I'm weird. I hang out with spiders. I'm like, oh, yeah, a spider. Cool. Let's hang out. You know? Because they're cool. And uh, I think he thought this ant was going to hurt me. So, right in front of me, he, like, killed this, sp this ant. And then this jumping spider literally brought it right up to me. And he set it on the ground. And then he, like, looked up at me. And he's put his little fangs... And he was just like taught. It was the weirdest thing. So I know I have weird t connections with spiders and shit. <laughs> Probably better with, um, yeah, insects and animals than I am people. <laughs> okay, enough about that. <clears throat> Terrell's now in session. The Honorable Judge T.T. Dog presiding. You know what we're going to do? We're going to check in on that energy of that person you're dealing with. And then, um, yeah, we're going to get it. We're going to hit it. And we're going to quit it. <laughs> my spider story <sighs> show okay show I don't know what that was show Whew. shuffle truffle get out my truffle sniffing hog Oh, we got some knights showing up here. Okay. Show! Okay, knights are showing up here. Ay, 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 ay. Oh, Connor Pisces down on the table. We've got the Knight of Swords. We've got the Knight of Pentacles. We've got Ten Swords here. The overall energy for the reading today is the Nine of Wands here. Uh, so, Nine of, or Knight of Pentacles, excuse me. Uh, Knight of Pentacles is a card of an independent single person. It's also a card of you know, getting liberated, it's a card of uh, abundance too here, a card of beauty. <clears throat> Knight of Swords down here on the table. Uh, this is all about somebody coming in here with some real quick communication to balance out a situation. Knight of Pentacles here, a slower moving, slower moving energy here. I don't know what's coming, what's going here. This is a weird en uh, energy coming through on the table. But, um, uh, yeah, Knight of Pentacles, he's the least romantic knight in the deck of tarot, um, but he's a reliable. Ten swords down here on the table. I better pull out my sword here, because, you know, like a good sword fight. So, ten swords here is ultimately, you know, a complete ending of a situation here. Um, it, there's something here that can no longer be denied, and this is the end, do 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 my only friend, the end. This is the end, beautiful friend. Okay, Jim Morrison, thank you. We've had enough of that. So, time to accept it and move it on, okay? All right, so let's talk to this Ten Swords here. What's this an end of here? Show me these Ten Swords. What's this person ending here? Ten Swords, let's go. Oh, they're ending their burdens. Oh, Time to put down your burdens here is what this person's coming. This person's putting down their burdens. Why are they putting down their burdens here? Why is this person putting down their burdens with the ten wands here? 
because their burdens have been giving them a lot of sleepless, rest, restless nights, a lot of anxiety here because they're not getting what they want here. Okay. All right. Okay. I get it. I get it. Wow. That energy moved in fast. Okay. Whew. Okay. Well, let's talk to the uh, Knight of Swords here. Because obviously the Knight of Swords got something to do or say here. Knight of Swords. What's going on? Why is this Knight of Swords? Ooh, what was that? Knight of Swords to the Hermit here. What's going on with the Knight of Swords to the Hermit? Before I open my truck and mouth up. Okay. Knight of Swords to the Hermit. Before I open my truck and mouth up is this person. Has been thinking about how rejected that they have been feeling here. Okay? So, Knight of Swords is coming in here to talk to you about how rejected they have been feeling here at the end of the day. Okay. All right. So, they want to talk about how rejected they've been feeling. Let's go one more around this four cups, please. It's like they were wanting you to take their... Oh, yeah. Three of cups here. Uno momento here. I was going to go... Just to make sure here. They've been feeling rejected here. And they've been feeling like you have been out moseying here on the streets. Pisces on the streets. <laughs> oh, the court. Pisces is not on the streets. I was joking. God, she's such a weather wench. Three cups to the four cups here. So, <laughs> you've been out on the streets here. They're feeling rejected because basically... They've been trying to give you love here, Pisces, and you don't really know it because they don't really show it. They think they're showing it, but they're ultimately not here, and so now it's like they're like basically looking here at these three cups, and they're like, Pisces has been out doing stuff, and I've been trying to give Pisces my love. Pisces keeps rejecting me here. Mm-hmm. Of course. Well, yeah, of course. If you're not uh, going to be, uh, you know, coming forth right, then just don't come at all. Right, guys? Yeah, right. Okay. Um, okay. I want to go over here to these nine swords, back to these nine swords, as to why this person is putting down their burdens here, and they are tired of the nine of swords energy. What's coming out of the nine of swords energy here? They're tired of holding back is what they're saying, too. Jeez. Why are they tired of holding back? Why are they tired of holding back? Because, <laughs> oh, my God. It's the Eight of Cups here. Oh, my God. <laughs> they're tired of holding back. They're tired of... Uh, it seems like they've been taking a lot of breaks here. <clears throat> All right, this Eight of Cups. So they're feeling this person's feeling really rejected. What else here under the Eight of Cups? Let's go. Sure. And they're tired about how they've been coming in on this situation. All right. So this person basically hasn't been coming very forthright to you, is what is coming out of this energy right here. They're not showing up here. Uh, they're tired of not showing up the way that they need to show up for you here. Okay? So they know they need to show up here a little bit better here. Okay, we're going to talk to the Knight of Pentacles here. Why is this Knight of Pentacles here? Why is the Knight of Pentacles energy here, please? Okay, Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so they're going through a wake the truck up moment here. Okay. Okay. <laughs> What's this wake the truck up moment here with judgment? What's the wake the truck up moment? Oh, boy. It's the death card here. It's a rebirth here. Boy, a lot of death energy lately here. What's this rebirth here? They're rebirthing here out of judgment here. What's going on here? <clears throat> okay. So they want to show up here now. With ten pentacles here. Okay, well, I got more than ten pentacles here, guys. If you just want to take my pentacles. <laughs> ah, the court quit hitting on Pisces. I can't help it, Judge. I can't flippin' help it. Okay, Judge, I'm sorry. 
So now it's like, now they're wanting to show up and be reliable here and offer you the full Monty here because this person's been not been showing up the correct way here. And because they don't show up the correct way, you basically don't put a lot of, you're not investing a lot of energy into this situation. Okay, right on. Let's go ahead. We're going to clear it off of the white sage and get the final messages on what this person wants to tell you. Ouch. Before we close off the reading. Ten swords. Reiterating here what I just said here. So, yeah. They're tired of all this. Uh, they're putting an end to the burdens here. And it's like they don't want to sh They don't want to hold back. They don't want to keep taking breaks. They don't want to keep showing up here as a page here. What else do you want to tell Pisces? What else do you want to tell Pisces? Let's go. What else? They're having a tower moment. They're drowning in their own cup of love here, Pisces. <laughs> and what else do we got here? Oh, they're feeling rejected. They're feeling the loss here. And this person here has been doing a lot of reflecting here. The Hermit card reiterating just what I said here about this person feeling like you're going out and that you've honestly been rejecting them. But... You've been rejecting them because they're just not showing up for you the way you need them to at the end of the day. Yeah. Okay. So, that was adjourned.